everyone, um, and welcome back. As you can tell, we're no longer in the United Kingdom, in Monmouthshire. Um, in fact, we have made it to France, and we've been here now for six days. I could just tell you everything that's happened. I mean, it's been a bit of a whirlwind, really. It's been a little bit surreal as well, because it's one of those things that you always imagine is going to happen, but then are a little bit sort of scared when you do. No matter how much you prepare for it, there's always going to be something you uh, you miss out. But still, never mind. Um, if you're watching this and this is the first time you've heard from me, I do apologise for having a bit of trouble with the communication side of things, telecommunication side of things. We haven't had any proper internet connection for the past, um, past week, but that's being sorted out. Plus, um, so it's been put on the internet cafe sort of thing, so it's sort of like, I can't sort of stay long, I have to leave. Um, so I do apologise for the lack of communication on my part. There's some pictures which will go up as well, as you may have seen already, one or two of the pictures of the region, or indeed of my, my mentor's house. Um, so this week, really, what, what have I been up to? I mean, it's been my first week, so I mean, sort of all the general admin side of things, it's sort of registering me within the school and sort of making everybody aware that I was here. I've been given a tour of both schools I'm teaching in now and met pretty much everybody I will be working with in the next year. So that's that's always good, um, and that was an interesting Monday, Tuesday sort of side of things, um, as well as obviously getting settled into this room, which is a nice room, and you can see obviously using the pictures on Facebook was be would be uh, would be all right. So Wednesday and yesterday I travelled to Marseille for the first time on the bus. It was a bit of a long journey, and um, yeah, it was was not the smoothest at that sort of hours of the day, but, you know, it was it was nice, and it was great to see Holly at the airport, and my gosh, she is fantastic, I didn't realise this until I was with her yesterday, if you're watching this in anticipation of seeing Holly, she's not here, she's, um, she's away, and she will be, she may feature, like I said, it's up to her really, but she may feature in the videos, later in the term so you know you've got to respect that it's a big sort of step so to speak so but if you are a friend of holly's um and you're watching this in anticipation of seeing her in france for the first time um like i said she can't be here with me today but i can assure you all that she's safe and well in marseille for now um but anyway back to back to this week um i will be back in a class, I'm observing classes this week, I observed two more classes on Tuesday and it was a real like, eye-opener and a really good experience for me to see exactly what's gone on um, in in terms of the class, because obviously the education system is a lot different in France than it is in the United Kingdom um, and I will be doing that again in about an hour's time, it's about 25 to 9 in the morning, we get woken at 6.30 every day for breakfast so I do apologise if one, I'm looking tired, or two, this is a very early video. And if this video has come on quite late, then I do apologise, because, like I said, due to the um, disparity with the internet connection, um, it can take time for me to contact people. But that may only be for now. I mean, once we get into the swing of things and the academic year picks up, I mean, this is the end of the second week, you know, officially, so it's going to take time. But never mind. Um, next week, uh, not really too, too much planned. I mean, hopefully we'll get the general admin side of things sorted up, so we'll have a bank account, we'll have, you know, a social security, a sort of an NI number, if you will, um, also available, readily available, and a French mobile number. My British one is still in service, so if you do, for whatever reason, feel like contacting me, it is going to cost you, and you will have to check with your operator, your network operator, before you do so. It is a little bit costly, but my phone will still be on, and it will be on the same number, uh, same British number. You just have to add plus four four and drop the first zero. But so all the sort of general living things should be completed by next week. There's no very little plan for the weekend. I mean, one or two of the other assistants in this town have arrived last night, but um, I was unable to meet them. So we may be meeting later today. Uh, sorry, not later today, um, over the weekend, well, we might be later today, but um, over the weekend, definitely, that's uh, that's on the cards, and I'll let you know how that goes in next week's video. But next week in general, like I said, it's just general admin plus, you know, observing more classes before next weekend, so a week tomorrow, um, we'll be back in Marseille with Holly then till 
Tuesday, uh, sorry, Wednesday evening, Thursday morning, so almost a week pretty much, because um, we go down there for the weekend, spend some time together, and then we'll be there because we've got training on a week Wednesday, sorry, yeah, week, week Tuesday, week Wednesday, so we have the ability to, um, to sort of, you know, become accustomed to uh, our new lives in a way, if that's uh, one way to play it, but... I'm afraid that's all I've got really time for this week. I've got to get ready to uh, to go observe another class and to be introduced to more people and things like that. So if this is a short video, then I do apologise. But um, like I said, you can follow my blog, my written blog, which I posted in last week's video and have been posting on Facebook. So if you want to watch one of those, then if you want to read those, they're a bit more in-depth than this. You know, it, it sort of talks how I feel and how I sort of thought was going to happen at the time whilst sort of talking through what I've done on a day-to-day -day basis but I hope I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope you enjoy these videos as well I mean this is a great way to talk to those back in the United Kingdom or wherever you are in the world who may not be available to sort of physically contact me on a regular basis but I hope that's all for now I hope the weather's um, just as good as it is here I mean I think we've been average 25 degrees Celsius since we've been here <laughs> since I've been here and I've been here six days now so, anyway, I hope all is well, wherever you are. I hope you've had a good week and you'll have a great week next week. That's all I've got time for, and I will guess I'll talk to you next Friday. If not, I hope you read my blog, which will go up probably Tuesday, Wednesday time, if not over the weekend. But that's all for now. Thank you very much. Merci beaucoup, and I will see you next week. Thank you. Goodbye.